close your eyes and restrict your attention to the body as you feel it right here. If your thoughts go out beyond the body, bring them right back. It's by paying careful attention here that you begin to realize there are potentials here. Potentials for happiness, potentials for well-being, right in this narrow area of your body here in the present moment. When they train photographers, one of the exercises they do is to give the photographer a very limited space and say, okay, within the confines of this space, make a good photo. It forces the photographer to look more carefully at what's there in the space. And often you end up seeing things you would never have seen before. It's good training for the eye. And it's the same way. Restricting your attention to the body right here is good training for your awareness, your powers of alertness, to see what's going on right here, what potentials there are right here that you ordinarily would have overlooked. And John Fuin calls it the grass at the corral gate. The gate opens, the cows inside the corral go running out into the field. And even though there's a nice patch of grass right next to the post there next to the gate, very few of them ever eat it. They run right past. So here's something right nearby with lots of potential. Think of a John Lee up in the forest, that rains retreat when he'd walked in for three days. And soon after he arrived, he had a heart attack. No medicine, no doctors, no one to help him. The one monk who was there was not very helpful. And so what did he have? He had his breath. And so he worked with his breath and was able to use the breath energies to heal his heart to the point where he was able to walk out at the end of the three months. So there's a lot of potentials here. If you narrow your focus, it forces you to see things that you might not otherwise might not have seen. And that's a lot of what discernment is. After all, the causes for suffering are right here, and the path for the end of suffering is also potentially right here. But we're sending our attention outside, looking at other places, and so we don't see what's right here. So focus your attention here. Learn how to develop the potentials that are right here, right next to you. The closest thing to the mind that you can know, the breath. It has a lot to offer.